Hello everybody, I am Tony. Welcome to my channel. If you've never been here before, special welcome to you. Today I'm going to be doing a get ready with me. I'm just going to be talking to you guys and basically just letting you know what's going on in my life and um, do my makeup and having a little bit of fun. So basically makeup makes me happy and in times like this when I'm fighting with my mental health I need to be made happy so we're just gonna do my makeup and hopefully I have an amazing look that comes out of it because I need that right now so I pulled out some old palettes and we're gonna see how these two work out wrong way halloween and spooked um this is from gourmand girls and this is from shroud cosmetics um i want to use the halloween palette i have been wanting to use that palette for a while but with the wild color scheme i just couldn't find it like i couldn't fit it in my daily routine it just didn't seem to work so i want to do my um eyes first so what i'm gonna do is um gonna do my eyebrows and then i will come back in and do whatever later i need to find yes that that and this okay I was using an e.l.f. Um, brow pencil and they don't last very long. <laughs> I really, really liked it, but they don't last very long. And at like $6 a pop, I could probably go through one a month. I guess that's not that much money considering what some of my makeup stuff costs, but I just, I don't know. I guess I don't look at it that way. I don't go through any products that fast, but the products I do use, if I went through them that fast, I probably wouldn't use them. Some of them, like I wouldn't use them that, either I wouldn't use them that often, or I just wouldn't use them. There goes that. I'm using the Benefit Goof Proof Brow Powder. So there goes that. I'm sorry if um, you've been on my channel in the past, say, month or two, and I've been grumpy. I just want to apologize. I know that I don't need to apologize to anybody about anything, but... um. I just, I, um, I've been getting a little bit of flack from my fiance. He does help me out with my channel. So, um, I have to take his criticism seriously because he means it when he says something. So, <clears throat> all right, let me get... I have this little Elf and J Kisser brush. It's a J1. And I'm gonna go into the orange that's in the Halloween palette. It's called Losers Club. It's like a dark burnt orange. That's what I would call it. And I don't use like eye primer. It makes my eyes crease. I know that it's like the total opposite of what it does for other people, but for me, it just creases like crazy. Even like NYX glitter glue creases on me. So when I go in with glitter, I will use something like what I'm gonna use today because I am gonna go in with glitter today. Um, I don't do glitter too often, but when I do, I like for it to stay. 
I mean, if I'm going to go through all the heck of putting glitter on, I might as well make sure it's going to stay where I put it. Um, all right, so let me put that on there. And then I'm going to blend these for a little bit. And then we'll get back into it. <sighs> Quit. I always want to go straight up to the eyebrows. Always. And I try not to, but I always just want to do it. Okay, we're going to take this and just buff this back and forth. And hopefully this isn't actually light blue like it looks like. All right. <clears throat> I don't have a whole ton of voice this morning because it's like 5 a.m. I didn't have a very good night's sleep last night. I was really sick yesterday and couldn't get out of bed. So I slept all day yesterday. So last night, no chance in sleep. Not a bit. So that was no fun. And probably will make today absolutely no fun. Um, but that's all right. I'll live. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, guys. You really don't need to be hearing me, like, barely breathing. <laughs> okay. We're just, I'm just stamping this kind of around so that it's moving the color around but the pigment is staying there okay I think that looks good I need a little bit more pigment in one spot so I'm gonna take the lightest touch of color on my blending brush and just go in with that which like I said I don't know if that's a mistake or not we shall see all right now I'll just let that go okay I'm going to look at my colors, figure out what I'm going to do for out of here. I think I'm going to go in with purple or there's this color in the spooked palette called Fright. It's right here. It's like purple and red mixed together. It's gorgeous. And with the, the, um, multi-chrome that I want to use out of the Halloween palette. Um, I think that might actually be perfect. So I'm going to take this color Fright from the Gourmand Girls palette and we're just going to, I'm going to come in just a little bit from where I was starting at because <sighs> I didn't mean to start this out that far. So I'm going to go out like a little bit. Okay. That looks cute. It needs work, but it looks cute for now. <laughs> Which side? There we go. Okay, again, I'm going to go in a little bit over top of that orange. See that right there? You see all that fallout? That is why I'm doing my eyes first. Okay, um, let me see. Do I have 
have makeup like cleaner probably not just because i need it <laughs> i might have to have you guys hold on a minute but that's all right no big deal um i can't believe how much fallout this has like i get i'm putting it on heavy but damn that is a lot okay i shall return in a moment and you let me grab this brush this is a michaela glam light uh zero one and i'm gonna take this and i'm gonna blend oh i lost a skull you know i found a real skull the other day i didn't like find it but it was at a store it was nineteen hundred dollars and i was with my mom she looked at me and literally was like, no, don't even think about it. And I was like, mom, and she's like, no, don't even think about it. I was like, but it's real. She was like, that's the point. I was like, that makes it so much cooler. <laughs> I try to let, I try to get away with everything when it comes to human anatomy and stuff like that I am absolutely mesmerized by it I don't know why like medical tools and things from back in the day and things along those lines I love it absolutely love it okay let's get this side blended out We're getting there. Let me get this little bit. Did I get it? I don't know. Alright, so there goes that. I think I'm going to grab this little wipe again. Go out here and then wipe down and across because I don't think I caught it all. And I don't want to leave junk on my face. Wouldn't be good. So... I don't understand why I'm getting so much fallout on one side and like none on the other. Okay. So anyway, that's blended out. It looks good. Let me clean my brush and my thing. And, um, I need to get a garbage bag in here. Sorry if I'm not paying attention to you. I'm trying to do something real quick. <laughs> I'm trying to clean my um my my cellar water bottle. It was dusty like right here. So I wanted to make it look better. The things that drive me insane, you know? Okay, so I'm gonna put my little cotton rounds away and I'm gonna go into the color pumpkin in Spooked. Yeah, I need a specific um, eyeshadow primer. It is in here. I'm a mess. I'm a total, total mess. Okay, let me get this open and I need one of these brushes. Okay, there's that. I'm going to take this and just go lightly over 
that orange part and it's clear so it's like see-through right now I'm just gonna put that thing aside and then immediately go in with this color pumpkin which is a glitter and I thought that this was a bad idea for them to put a glitter in here until I used it I really like this glitter it is absolutely beautiful and the shifts that it has, it's amazing. Okay. Sorry if I'm looking down and I can't see you guys because I need to look in the mirror a little closer than just looking in the um, camera feed, whatever you call it. I can't ever remember. <clears throat> okay, so there goes that, that's my orange. Um, I am quite happy with that. I'm going to wipe that orange off of this brush. This is my like sparkly stuff brush. I'm going to put that away and then we're going to go into the Halloween palette for the color Black Flame, which is this color and it looks purple to you guys. To me right now, it looks kind of purple, kind of black, kind of rosy, and then kind of green. It's a really trippy color. I don't know what else to call it besides that. So I'm going to get this packed up with it, this brush, and then I'm going to spray it. I like to spray my brush. It makes my eyeshadow last longer, or at least I tend to think so. So, yeah. All right. There goes that. Um, so I'm going to get a big glob of it again, and I guess, let me see, this, okay. All right, so I just basically took this and swiped it on my eyes. I think that looks really cute. Um, let me clean this brush in the color switch and then we're good as far as that goes. I'm gonna take another micellar wipe and I'm gonna wipe my face down and make sure that I don't have anything anywhere and then we'll get into the rest of the makeup um and I'm glad that I will be definitely um taking some of this off because I'm already 20 minutes in and I know you guys don't want to be bored with me that long okay <clears throat> there's that okay so, done with the eyes for now, I think. Um, I might go back in. Well, no, I am going to go back in with the color Ghost. Ghoulish. The white in here. To do, like, inner corners and brow bone and all that. Um, but yeah, here we go. Where is... 
This is my Rare Beauty Foundation. Just gonna put this on like normal, but I'm gonna be extra freaking careful because I'm doing right around my eyes that I just spent 20 minutes on. And I didn't even do anything special to them yet. Might not at all, but we shall see. All right, there's that. <clears throat> So, how are y'all doing? I hope wonderful. I always say that to you guys, but one day, one of you will tell me how you're doing. Um, anyway, I wanted to talk to you guys about, like, my health and well-being and all that stuff. Um, I'm not doing the greatest, like, mentally, so... Um, I was talking to a couple people, like, through YouTube, and, um, I came to the conclusion that it might be a really good idea to take a break. So, like, I'm not monetized or anything, so it's not gonna hurt me in any way possible, um, but I just, I need some time for myself, I guess you could say. All right, let me get this. We're gonna try this puff. I used this once and I decided I hated it after using it once. So I'm gonna give it another try. This is by One and Other. I think I got this at CBS. I don't buy everything at bougie stores. I am going to do a video um, in the future. I don't know how soon it will be, but I mean, it might be one of my next videos up, honestly. But um, I'm going to do a video showing you guys uh, what I started my channel with makeup wise, because I started as a fully makeup channel and <clears throat> I wanted you guys to see how much makeup I actually started my channel with, which it's pretty amazing when you get down to it. Um, I'm going to use the Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer. And then in this Juicy Cheeks palette, I'm not sure. I think I'm going to go in with the color Squeeze. I don't want to go too harsh, but at the same time, like, don't want to... Let me get a little bit more over here. All right. There's that. Let me see this. That's better. Okay. Now, I'm going to take this little Rude Cosmetics highlighter that is literally a glitter bomb. But... I don't mind a glitter bomb highlighter. Like, that's all me. Why not? And we're just gonna run that on my cheeks and that makes the 
orange kind of fade a little bit, which is amazing because that was bright as heck. All right, there goes that. Now, I forgot to do my, I'll, before I put on powder, literally every day, I forget to use these two products every day. And you would think I would remember sooner or later, but I forget every time, every stinking time. Okay. I need to find a, um, lip pencil. Is this dark purple? It is. That'll work. Okay. This is the Rick and Morty lip pencil from Glam Light. And then we're gonna go in with this LA Girl um, black matte lipstick. I'm gonna put this right here in the corner <laughs> and right here. And then same thing on the other side, but get your whole lip, <laughs> not the whole lip, but I don't know. Hold on. It's like impossible to do this and talk. Okay. Try to keep a gap open. I failed at this miserably this time. And I have the NYX suede in violet smoke okay I like the drastic like color difference but there isn't a drastic color difference and I don't have much to wipe these this off with let me see All right, we're just gonna let it go at that. I don't wanna waste too much of this I'm trying to fix my lip. Okay, so let me do some, all right, let me get a little brush, little eyeshadow brush. I'm gonna go into the color Ghoulish and I'm going to mark that little inner corner and this one. <clears throat> I'd like them to be a little bit darker or brighter, whatever you want to say. So I'm going to go in a little bit more and a little bit more over here. <clears throat> now over here and over there. There goes that. Um, I don't want to put the palette away. That wouldn't be good because it would be a loss. Okay. <clears throat> I'm going to use this reddish orange. Um, eyeliner. Right there in the middle. And then I'm going to go in with another color for the outer half. 
that's like a um <clears throat> what is it it is like a almost like a wine color i gotta find it though yes i do it's a white thing i think yeah there it is okay so let me put that back on there all right let me use the Okay, there goes that. I'm gonna take that and then I'm gonna take my black liner and go up top. I know it's weird and creepy. Some people can do that, some people can't, but as long as I'm not messing up my contacts, like I'm fine with it. But like doing my upper waterline, tight line, whatever. I don't know what it's called, but we're going to go in with this little, um, what is it? Lancome Idol Ultra Precise Liner, which if you ask me, I can't even see it, but that's okay. I guess I can see it. Like, I'm not totally lying. <laughs> it's there. It's just not, like, crazy there. Alright. So, there's that. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna put on some lashes. I will cut this out for you guys so you don't have to watch me. Alright, guys. There goes my lashes. I am getting there. I need to give them a second to like soak in, like get the glue flat down and everything before I put mascara on. Um, so anyway, I never really talked to you guys about me taking a break that much, but I think I'm going to, and I'm not going to take a long break or anything. It's just going to probably be like a week to 10 days. And I will post on my community tab that I'm going to be taking a break so you guys will be totally aware and um you know it's not going to be that long and I feel like I'm deserting you guys or something but I just need to have a little bit of time to where I don't feel I don't need to feel responsible for anything I just need time to be be me and don't worry about anything else. Just be me. I know that sounds probably selfish, but it is what it is. And I'm sorry, but like, what am I going to do? You know, um, I've been through a lot since I got this channel a lot. And I think there was only one or two times that I actually took a break and it was only for like a week or two, something like that. And ever since then, I've been posting and posting and posting and posting and it honestly, it's just like, um, Why do I always do that? I always get mascara on the inner corner of my eye. Always, always, always. It drives me nuts. I think I might do some crystals today too. I don't know. And I have an itch right here on my chin that will not stop. Like, I really don't want my thumbnail picture to be of my chin being bright red for me scratching it but I might not have a choice because 
it's itchy. I gotta put something on it. I don't know if I got bit by something in my sleep or what, but okay. I hope that this look looks okay. What do you guys think? You'll have to let me know in the comments. I love it when you guys comment. You really make my day and it means a whole hell of a lot to me. So don't forget to comment. Um, if you're still here with me in this video, I would love it. You don't have to talk. You don't have to say hi. You don't have to do anything like that. Leave me a Halloween emoji. That's all I need to know that you guys were here. I really would appreciate it. Um, so thank you, you guys. I love you. I appreciate each and every one of you. Wherever you guys are, whatever time of day it is, I hope you're having a great one. And I will talk to you guys very, very soon. All right. Bye, guys.